judgment will bring our nation in order. I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai Bahashem, Rachak Wadash, double honor to the apostles, elder bishops of the Great Millstone, who rule well, peace, and blessings to you, fellow brothers, pushing this word in truth and sincerity. Shabbat Coming back with another lesson through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai Bahashem, Rachak Wadash. And this is just kind of, you know, the spirit's kind of on me. The spirit's on me, actually, just to, you know, do a video real quick, you know, early morning. Um, you know, I just got out of, I'm just getting out of the house. And I felt it. Uh, I was watching the video from uh, the brother. I believe the brother's out there in L.A., but not to Zach. GM has to get this work. If I'm not mistaken, you know, it's going into how, you know, the especially in, in particular, the black woman. You know, uh, the so-called black, the so-called black man, you know, really, it, really Judah, you know, Judah, which is the head tribe. <laughs> no, nope, nobody wants to deal with the black woman. OK, no, no, absolutely. Nobody wants to deal with her because she's just completely she's just completely out of control. OK, and certain certain up certain women are, are going to see that certain women see it and are trying to. You know, basically trying to get in order before, you know, things really, you know, uh, you know, really take take root in the earth. This judgment that takes root in the earth. You, so you got certain sisters that are seeing that from the tribe of Judah that are going to get right. So you do you do have women from, you know, so-called black women, Judah, Benjamin, Levi, that will, you know, will get in order and will be uh, delivered. Absolutely. You're going to have a lot of them. Um, but on the other on the other side of that, we, we also speak of greatly how there's going to be a lot of judgment that's going to come to these women here in Babylon, in particular, the so-called black woman, because nobody wants you. And, it, you know, you're, you're dealing with the, uh, the so-called black woman. You know, it's like the lowest is really it's really the lowest woman you can deal with just because of her 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 attitude. The way that she looks at things, and Esau Edom, he caters to that, and he and he did that on purpose. But it's really is the the wickedness that's inside of their heart. This is these are the curses. And then I wanted to do a video yesterday. Maybe, maybe the spirit might be on me to do it. It was this individual. Um, I believe the channel's called Negro Knowledge. <laughs> uh, you know, basically showing people how to. He's he, a, a so-called black guy. He looked like he can be like. West African in a in a tank top and sunglasses on, saying how he can br how you can break out of the uh, transgenerational curses. So I might go into that. But ultimately, judgment. Let me go to Ezekiel. Judgment is going to get ultimately all our people in order, starting with the elect. Okay, starting with the elect. Judgment is going to bring everything into order because when things when when things. And see, the woman, she's, a, she's like the epic survivor. She's like the top survivor. When she sees that she has no other choice, she'll humble down. But as soon as she has advantage, you know, she, she's going to exert her power. But the Most High is getting ready to strip uh, power away from E and uh, strip power away from the woman. Because that's that pact, that, uh, that Gardidian pact between... Uh, the serpent in Eve, and she's feeling it. You know, I, I, I've never been uh, been out with a, you know a couple of white women before, and also good, good looking white women. And, and the the ones that I get the the worst look from, they 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 look like they they hate me. Is that uh is that black woman? Okay. This is uh, Ezekiel nine and four, and the Lord said unto him, Go through the midst of the city the midst of the Jerusalem and set a mark upon the four the foreheads of the men that sigh and cry for all the abominations that be done in the midst of and and who's doing that there's only certain men on the earth that are truly sighing and crying for all for all these abominations that are going on in the earth and some of those abominations which is a lot really is uh, the woman our women just completely out of control I don't meet no man this and that will keep keep that same energy.
keep that same energy. And, and what's going on now is Jake. Jake is not dealing with the black woman. Jake. Jake is uh, going overseas. You you see Jake, uh, uh, the so-called black man. He he uh, he's he getting with the white woman. He's getting with the Asian women. And 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 and, and having and having seed too. Actually, actually having seed. Okay. Having having children, and um, I see I see that all the time, especially the area that I'm in. You got you got all type of uh, mix. It's nothing but mixed mixed children, so so called. They call you know so called mixed children. I see Jake with Elam, with Moab, with Ammon. Okay, with uh, Edom. Okay. Uh, Ham too. Okay. And very rarely you see Jake. When you see Jake with the, with, with with his own people, he he doesn't. He's not looking. He's not smiling. Okay, he's not having a good time. All right, so the Lord is going to set a mark on the, the true men of the Lord. Okay, and, and that mark is going to also fall upon their household. So the women and the children that are under, you know, under uh, uh, his, his, his protection. And if the women, if they keep, if they keep the obedience, because remember, the scriptures talk about remember uh, Lot's wife. You know, uh, Lot, Lot's wife would have been a super Israelite, right? But then when when things started getting taken away, she she looked back. And to the others, he said, in my hearing, go, go ye after him through the mid, through the city and smite. Let let not your eyes spare, neither have pity. Slay utterly old and young. Both maids and little children and women. But come not near any man upon whom is the mark and begin at my sanctuary then they began at the ancient men which were before the house and i brought that out just to highlight that the most high doesn't have respects of persons uh, when it comes to uh, women as well as old as well as young as you know children okay if if you if you were in the crosshairs of the heavenly father Okay, he's he's gonna take you out, and a lot of the a lot of you women, you're in the crosshairs of the heavenly Father. Okay, uh, you, you, so-called Israelite women too, you know, come to this thing, thinking that you know, bringing that feminist shit, like a, a man is supposed to bow down to you. You must be out of your damn mind. You better go somewhere else with that. Okay, and uh, basically, judgment is either gonna do one or two things. For our people, it's either gonna get them in order, or it's gonna take them out. So I, you know, it was short. It was, you know, I didn't want to make this long. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna close until next time. Shalom to the leg.